Good morning, everyone. It is Saturday. Woo, woo. Hey. Early. It, yeah, super early. Um, I'm heading over to work. It's about 7 a.m. That's fucking nuts. Yeah. But yeah, heading over to work. Um, what's going on? Look, at you, check out my hair. I used to do my hair like this all the time. Remember? Yeah, back when you were a milkmaid. Stupid. So basically, this is two. Ooh, the sun is like right there. Two messy fishtails. Spread it apart and then pulled it apart so it was a little bit messier. And then, yeah, I don't know. And then pin it up. Yeah, basically. <laughs> <laughs> no, I crisscross it and hey, maybe I should do a tutorial, but isn't it like pretty saturated with these tutorials? You're asking people on YouTube if they want to see a tutorial. Of course they do. Aww. They've seen how other people do it, but how do you do it? Shut the door. All right, so just in case I don't do a tutorial, because, you know, I don't know, I just... Gosh, when I get... To, the reason why I don't do hair tutorials quite often is because by the time I'm home, I work a lot. So by the time when I am home, I just kind of want to veg out or, like, just relax, you know? Call me human, but, you know... <laughs> I do work for a living, you know? But I do enjoy doing vlogs, so yeah. Here's how I did it. So basically, my hair is really dirty, so I don't think there was any way of saving it because it was like maybe day four or day five. I don't really know anymore. Um, so I split it down the center, did, created two fishtails, and then spread it apart so it was messier and more texture because you don't want perfect braids. Unless you're creating like a specific look, but a normal day-to-day -day thing, you kind of, if you're going for that braid thing, the messier the better, in my opinion. So I spread it apart, crisscrossed it up on top, as you guys could see here, with two little, can you imagine there's actually just three bobby pins up there? Yeah, three bobby pins securing that shit. That's fucking nuts. Maybe I'm, I'm kind of like exaggerating there. There's three little bo like Nishida bobby pins holding it together and then I have these like um, Nishida U-pins and if you guys are wondering what Nishida is it's a brand of hair pins that I use from Japan I've used it for I don't even know for as long as my hair career and they're the best because they're made for like Asian thick hair so it kind of works for everyone um, but they're these U-pins kind of secured them all around so you never see actual Pins. At least I hope you don't see any pins because that's my pet peeve is when you see like bobby pins on like updos It just takes it all away. It's just sloppy and messy and just not a fan of like Whoa, don't run over the old lady. I'm in the middle or of the, the old man. Um, he's not really Um, so as I was saying, yeah, my pet peeve when people do updos is when you see hairpins It's a no-no in my opinion Unless you're doing it specifically like hey side part and then bobby pins in the design and I get that but overall you should never see hair pins so yeah that's my little tangent in the morning it's seven o'clock I said like I said and I'm gonna work um the plan is do some hair kill it with the hair and then I want to go to the grove I want to buy some like succulents yeah weird right you'll see you'll see later today see you in a bit bye oh wait here's there Maybe you can see it a little bit better. The messier the better. I finally broke my iPhone. Right when I was like content on just keeping it. Right in like the worst timing ever. Why, why is it worst timing? Because you're not, the new iPhone's coming out, but they're all, um, I think they're all like sold out, so there's gonna be no iPhones for you. Oh, you're like, so, then I'm SOL. You're SOL. So hey guys, we are uh, headed to the Grove. Yeah, I'm gonna buy some succulents. You're probably gonna buy a new iPhone too. No. Or just get it repaired. Maybe. I don't know. I walked in to pick up Anna, and I see an iPhone go flying out into the air, and then crash onto the floor. 
And I've dropped it so many times and I used to joke around that I wanted it to break. Yeah. But then when I found out how much the new iPhone cost, I was like, oh, I'll, I'll hold on to this. Yeah. <laughs> We did this on purpose. And maybe I did. Yeah, maybe I did. So we're in a we're in a beer garden. Bring me my beer. Beer wench. Beer wench. You said it about me. There's a new beer garden at the farmers market in the beer. Is it new? It's new. It's, I think it's only been open for a couple of weeks, a couple of months, maybe. Yeah. Oh, we're gonna give it a try. Yeah, and it changed your into a Zara? Zara t shirt. I don't like it. <laughs> she was wearing a sweater, so it's like 99 degrees out still. So. so we're gonna eat and then we're sucking. Mm -hmm. You still want to go shop? Oh, we gotta go yeah. fix your phone. Or find out what like, we're gonna do. Can I just like not use my phone? <laughs> I'm already like trying to figure out like what to do. Like maybe I should just switch my SIM card, your SIM card into my phone no. so you can use it. It's okay. I, I can live without a phone for Prost. October fest, October fest. Okay. Where's your look? Uh, I don't know. Selfie camera on the 6S Plus is amazing! Look at that! Wow! Anna. 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 What? Would you say that was a succulent cess? It's a little stretching it. Success. They're a little stretching that. They're stretching that just a little bit, babe. No. Okay, bye. Bye. Hey guys, don't forget to subscribe if you like this video. You can like it too, and you can comment. That would be awesome as well. But it'd be really awesome if you'd subscribe. Right, Anna? Yep. Okay, bye. Bye.